Hey everybody, welcome back to another Triple Hound video, and we're making more custom skins in Fortnite, and we got a request kind of a while ago now to make the Nebula who appears in Marvel's What If television show. So What If is kind of an animated show on Disney Plus in which Marvel characters are in alternate universes uh, or are kind of seen playing out alternate versions of history and things like that and nebula shows up in one of those episodes but not the nebula that we've seen in the rest of the mcu with the sort of the bald head kind of speckled with metal parts and whatnot but rather with long blonde hair so that's the version that was requested and that's the version we're making the what if version of nebula actually is kind of doable so here is how we did it to start with we used Used the Joltara skin uh, mostly because she's got the long hair now where this falls apart a little bit is that the nebula in what if has long blonde hair and it is like blonde blonde all the way down to the roots here uh, we can add blonde coloring to the long hair that this character has but it only kind of goes on the tips so it is blonde but it's not as blonde as it would be if we had it colored all the way down to the roots so it, it it's not perfect but uh, we our other choice was to use a dynamo dancer who's got naturally lighter hair but it's not long like this and we really wanted to do the long hair suit pattern victorious uh, again hairstyle a that long hair that we've been talking about eye mask off but belt on Primary material is cloth, primary color is indigo, secondary material is metallic, and the secondary color is purple. Now, this character in the show has got sort of a multi-layered different kinds of purple with um, black trim, and I actually think this captures it pretty well. I know it's not perfect, but I actually do think that this captures it pretty well. It's got kind of the vertical striped alignment uh, thing going on, and I think it I think it really gets the, the two tones of purple together pretty well. I like it a lot. Accessory color is black. It's really the only way we can get that black back into the outfit. I think she's got like a black holster or something on her leg, but uh, we can't add that to the customizable boundless skin, but we can give her a black belt. Eye effects off, eye color off, skin tint steel blue, hair tint yellow. Again, we're trying to give her that bright blonde hair and no sticker is necessary. No back bling really made sense. Uh, I guess if you wanted, you could go a Guardians of the Galaxy type theme and add maybe Rocket or Sapling Groot or maybe even the Infinity Gauntlet. But really in all of these cases, it's not quite right. I don't believe that in the What If episode that this character is taken from that the Guardians actually have Rocket and Groot with them. I think that's the alternate version of the history that they have. I'm trying to remember the episode, and certainly correct me in the comments if I'm wrong. It's been a long time since I watched the first season of What If, which is where this is from, but I don't think they had Rocket and Groot with them. So these are both a little bit out of place for this version of Nebula. Widow's fangs as a harvesting tool uh, work pretty well. You could also give her some kind of double blades that would make sense for her. I did give her the Milano spaceship, the Guardians of the Galaxy spaceship, falling fate mostly for its purple color scheme more so than anything else. Similarly, I used the Kevin wrap as the wrap because it's purple, and then just sort of fighting type emotes here, martial arts master, ones that we've used a lot, evasive maneuvers because she's super athletic. Widow's pirouette, a walker's kata, stuff we've all seen before. And yeah, that's how I made the the nebula 
from Marvel's What If television show. Now we've done a handful of videos so far kind of uh, based on the What If television show, including the uh, T'Challa version of Star-Lord and some of the zombie type characters. We've done some zombie Marvel characters that came up in the What If television show. Captain Carter is another one. We also did the version of Gamora from What If and the zombie hunter Spider-Man who's got like the Doctor Strange cape on him. So we've definitely milked the What If side of the Marvel Universe for a good handful of these custom skins now and there's just here's just another one to throw onto the pile. Thank you very much for the request. Uh, please do like and subscribe and if you have other requests for skins please do drop them down in the comments below. Uh, we'd love to see all the ideas. I have to say every time we don't always make every single version uh, or every single suggestion that we get down in the comments but we love to see all the ideas and frequently when we don't make them it's not because the idea wasn't good but rather because there's just no good way to make that particular character using the tools we currently have available to us in Fortnite. So uh, check us out on Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram. Use code TripleHound on the Fortnite item shop or Epic Games store. Hashtag ad and uh, we'll see you guys next time. Have a great one. Bye-bye.